Hey, what's going on, guys? It's your boy Warrior HD here, bringing you guys some more Black Ops 2 information, focusing on Nuketown 2025. But before I get stuck into it, I just got a couple of things to say about the gameplay. It's going to be a 3 minute and 12 second TDM, 46 and 0 rushing gameplay with the Spaz 12. But I pretty much spend the majority of the time in my chopper gunner. Uh, only because it was so fast, I pretty much uh, earned it and got in it and hopped out and the game was over. <laughs> it was really fast, I picked up about 30 kills in that chopper gunner, absolutely raped the other team. Uh, yeah, they had no chance. <laughs> uh, but yeah, this is pretty much why, uh, me personally at least, I absolutely love Nuketown for the fact that it's so open, small, action-packed, and how well kill streaks do, the double rainbow at the back, you know, just, just those extra little features, you know, it really makes it the icon of Black Ops in my opinion, but anyway, back to Nuketown 2025. Uh, Nuketown 2025, if you guys didn't already know, is going to be a free multiplayer DLC map available in Black Ops 2 if you pre-order now, so... I'm not sure whether this is going to be a strictly uh, kind of a strict feature that you're only going to be able to download if you pre-order it, or maybe only free to the people who pre-order it. I'm not sure, guys. But one thing I'm sure of, uh, you're definitely going to want to pre-order Black Ops 2. It's not like it's going to cost you anything extra, and you'll definitely uh, you'll definitely know that you're uh, going to be getting Nuketown 2025. Because I'd really hate to miss out on that, guys. Uh, yeah, but currently I'm waiting on the Hardened and Prestige editions to be released, that's why I haven't actually pre-ordered it yet. I'm really curious to see what they'll include in it this time, uh, whether it'll be something like what they did with Modern Warfare 3, whether they'll have like free DLC and stuff like that. I think that was a really cool idea, and uh, yeah, but they'll be releasing those around about mid-September, I presume, like they did with Modern Warfare 3. And yeah, that's just about all I've got to say, guys. Uh, hope you guys enjoy the rest of the gameplay. And remember to leave, drop a like if you enjoyed it, and peace. The secret side of me, I never let you see. I keep it caged, but I can't control it. So stay away from me, the beast is ugly. I feel the rage and I just can't hold it. It's scratching on the walls, in the closet, in the halls. It comes away and I can't control it. Hiding under the bed, in my body, in my head. Why won't somebody come and save me from this?